Christmas. It's great to be with you. And let's light the tree. First Lady will do the honors. We'll do it. Ten in reverse. Are you ready? All together. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Milani and I are thrilled to be here today as we celebrate one of the nation's most cherished traditions, the lighting of the national Christmas tree. Truly a great, great country. We're very proud of it, and we love it deeply. For Christians all across our nation, around the world, this is a sacred season that begins 2,000 years ago when Jesus Christ was born, an angel declared to the shepherds tending their flocks, Behold, I bring you good tidings, great joy, which shall be to all people. For unto you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, which is Christ the Lord. There in Bethlehem, Mary and Joseph held in their hands the Son of God, the light of the world, and through him the promise of eternal salvation. No matter one's faith or beliefs, the Christmas season reflects all that is best in the American spirit. This is a time of the year for rejoicing with our family and friends, for spreading charity and goodwill in our commitment all over this country, in all of our communities, and for giving thanks for all of the blessings in our lives. We are especially thankful for the countless Americans who have given their time and passion to help those in need. At this time of the year, we renew the bonds of affection between our fellow citizens, and we awaken the faith in our hearts that calls each of us to action. As we gather loved ones, our thoughts turn to those who are rebuilding their lives after devastating wildfires, destructive hurricanes, and terrible tragedy. We are one American family. We hurt together. We heal together. And we will always pull through together. This is the United States of America. We are the best in the world, and there's nobody close. Tonight, we honor the first responders, who risk their lives to save the lives of others. And all of America sends our profound gratitude to the incredible men and women of the United States military, their families are all our families, and we thank them so much for their greatness and for the incredible job they do. Thank you to the United States military. Thank you very much. We ask God to watch over this nation's heroes and to shed His almighty grace upon our nation. And we pray that America's light will shine more brightly and stronger than ever, and it will. On behalf of Melania and myself and the entire Trump family, many of whom are with us tonight, 
I want to again wish you all a very, very Merry Christmas. May this Christmas season bring peace to your hearts, warmth to your homes, cheer to your spirit, and joy to the world. Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry Christmas, and God bless you. Thank you. Thank you very much.